shit is so delicious. Hello friends, my name is Brandon Data and I am your humble narrator. Welcome back to Project Zomboid. It is fucking early, early in the morning, but I got a nice fresh baseball bat and uh, kind of a plan. I kind of just want to get back home, all things considered. I mean, my bags are mostly full, um, not necessarily with a bunch of stuff that I need, but it could be a stuff, bunch of stuff that I want. I also got my uh, Hippo, Monkey, Octopus, Rabbit, Stegosaurus, T-Rex, Triceratops <laughs> dolls, which we're going to have a... A tea party. Don't you enjoy a tea party? Hmm? And for for being two in the morning, these zombies are pretty uh pretty sleepy, I think. I thought their sleep schedule was like reverse or something. But I guess that's not the case. Which is good for me. Good for me, good for me. I'm yeah, wanting to search a bunch of these houses, but I don't really have uh, a lot of room for things. I should probably just clear out some zombies just to clear them out. Level up that blunt accuracy, as always, and then uh, we'll never die. We'll never die, because we can one-hit zombies while they're still standing up, and uh, I don't know what's happening with the electricity or the power or whatever. Do I, do I still have water? Let's have a drinky drink. Seems I do. Fill up these bottles. That seems a good idea. So, water's still on. Seems that the fridge is still going. Yeah, I can hear it just a little bit. So, um, no complaints yet. Everything seems to be going fine. It's a little, uh, bakery or something like that. What do you, what do you, what do you call that? A bakery? Uh, 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 I think it's just a restaurant. Bakeries don't have chocolate pops, gickles. Unless you're, like, making a fudge sickle cupcake or something like that. Oh my god, that sounds so good. But it wouldn't really be a fudge sickle after you turn it into a cupcake. Because cupcake got to go in the oven. Actually, I saw uh, cupcakes that you don't have to cook. Like, no, no baked cupcake or something like that. And that seemed really interesting to me, but I'm not a baker, so... So pass. <laughs> I'm, not gonna, I'm not gonna embarrass myself. Fuck up some cupcakes. You know, it seems like a really easy thing to do. Cooking. But it ain't. Not really. Get some trail mix. Huh. That's nice. And uh, I think I just have to run down this road. I have to keep running down this road until I find my uh, my house again. Which, oh god. I shouldn't have come so far out this way. But we did what we did. And we can't take it back. So but we can take it back. It's just gonna take a little while to take it back, so no worries. I'm not. I'm not sweating it too much. There was uh, where the alarm went off, and I almost fucking died. You remember that when I almost fucking died? Wasn't that so fun? No, no, it wasn't. My heart was pounding through my chest, and uh, I almost shit my pants. And it seems like the zombies have basically set up residence there. There's the warehouse I slept at before. Yeah, that's all coming back to me now. I still kind of don't want to run on the road just because there might be some more interesting stuff over on the side. But uh, there's two sides to the road, so you got to pick a side. Right? Left versus right. Come on, pick a side. You can't just be a human. You've got to uh, fit into our narrative. <laughs> that was a little political commentary. Uh, thank you so much. I'll be here all week. Probably, maybe, unless I miss an upload, which I feel really bad when I miss YouTube uploads, you know that? It shouldn't uh, bug me as much as it does, but <laughs> yeah, my wife is scared by zombies too. <laughs> um, yeah, it's just a day, you know? What's a day without the date and does? I don't know. Sometimes I get a Twitter DM or something, and they're like, I was looking for your video, and... Skyrim wasn't there, and I'm like, God damn it. Uh, people are just gonna forget about me if I don't uh, keep the grind up. But, I don't know. Sometimes you need to take a day off. Sometimes you just, uh, you can't hit all the marks. You know what I mean? I really, really try, but uh, sometimes I fail miserably. 
I'm really kind of jealous of channels that uh, upload once per week, you know? Uh, I probably could put a lot more effort and editing into the videos and have text pop-ups and funny things like that going on, but, um, yeah. It, I haven't really, uh, decided on a, a direction for videos like that. If I did something, uh, like a review or something like that, it would make it a lot easier if I was only doing, like, that type of content, but when you pair it up with long-form Let's Plays like I do, it, uh, it gets a little difficult to, to squeeze time in for uh, those longer form videos. There's a turn in the road here, which I don't know if I'm supposed to take. I don't remember running this way, but it's also been a little while since I booted up the Project Zomboids, so... Mmm, hard to say, hard to say. Uh, the typhoons in the Philippines haven't been so bad today at least. <laughs> Maybe we can avoid some rainfall, which would be really, really nice for me. If it does start raining, I'll just be like, okay, creepypasta time. But, um, it's been a pretty sunny day. It's hot as shit. I'm sitting here sweating my balls off, which, uh, I guess helps me get into character, you know, because my character's, like, running fucking 20 miles to get back home and stuff like that. I don't want to stop and fight any of these zombies because I got that high exertion going. I would uh, sit down and sleep in a house or something like that, but we seem to be out of the range of all the houses, which is not good. Muldra, down that way. Oh, uh, Riverside was released for Project Zomboid, which I thought was pretty cool. I'm going to run down this way, see if I can find another house. I seem to just be going in a big circle. I'm so dumb. Okay, let's not do that. <laughs> let's change our mind immediately about that. It's not going to be a good idea. Really, I need to run up in this corner uh, in order to get back to my house. And eventually we'll hit the water and uh, I'll be able to, to find my shack again. But I don't, I don't want to trek through the woods. That seems like a really fucking bad idea. And uh, it's mostly going to be a black screen, which is just boring as hell. <laughs> <laughs> it does happen. I've done it before um, in the videos with Playintosh. God, that seems like such a long time ago now. Oh, so many people weren't here when Playintosh was around. But um, yeah, you can still visit his channel, youtube.com slash Playintosh. And, uh, you know, he specialized mostly in, in Mac games, which might be the reason that he quit. <laughs> because there's no games for Mac. <laughs> No good games, at least. Windows got all the good shit. Actually, yeah, Project Zomboid's on the Mac, too, so I take it back. You can just play Project Zomboid for the rest of your life. That's fine. But, uh, yeah, most of the new releases and things like that, a lot of uh, game demos and things that show up in my email, they're like, Windows only, which uh, makes good sense to me. Most people have a Windows machine because they're fucking easy to build. And, uh, yeah, if you want a Mac, you gotta pay through the nose for it. You can also have, like, your little Hackintosh or whatever and, uh, build it yourself, but I assume it's a little bit more complicated. I'm not really sure because I never really tried. I just heard Windows was the easiest, so I'm like, cool, let's do that. And then you just kind of plug all the puzzle pieces in and your computer starts working. And you're like, cool. Oh, wait, I still don't have speakers for this computer. <laughs> There's an onboard sound card on my motherboard, but I don't have any speakers for that. Which was a, a complication that I had in the first couple weeks. Oh, here's a little diner. Ain't that so nice. We can lay down for a little bit in here. I've been here before. I think there used to be two pinball machines here, and then I uh, destroyed one of them. Let's... should we sleep? I don't really want to sleep. There's a bunch of zombies wandering around. Ah, uh, it would be so much easier if I could sleep on the toilet. <laughs> Who hasn't said that before? Who hasn't had that thought? All I want to do is sleep on the toilet. Okay. Let's uh, clear out some of the baddies. And then maybe I can have a, a little nappy nap. And then, it, then it won't be uh, 5 in the morning. Oh, my exertion's way too high for this. It's not good. 
Oh lord. Okay, I'll rest. I'll rest for just a second, close the door. And then uh, I'll get my exertion gone. But then am I gonna need to nap? Probably not. That's not gonna make much sense. There you go. Bang on the door. This is fine. Slam your stupid head into the door. Boom, 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 boom. Okay. It's 7 in the morning. We're still doing the thing. Stay away from the zombies. Ah, uh, oh, look at how much easier that is. Got that gold chain bling and some earrings. Dang. You decked out, girl. Hey, girl. You look at fly. Who says that? Fly. <laughs> what is this, 1980? We don't even have the internet. Or some people do. But their computers are as big as their house. And I wish my computer was as big as my house with the current technologies that we have. Oh my god. It would be so fucking awesome, except I couldn't move it anywhere. Okay, and now it's raining. In game. <laughs> In game, not at my house. There's some thunder. Thunder and lightning. Surely it's frightening. Did, have I been here before? I don't. I thought I recognized that diner. But the diners all kind of look the same. Hmm. There's a, a dead person at the gas station, so. I probably have been here before. Hmm. Oh, and there's a stool! This is the first bit of a uh, rest that we've been able to have in a gas station. Holy shit! It's got like a bed and all kinds of stuff back here. This is really nice. Hey! Y'all got quite a setup here, huh? Let's see if we can find some, some more stuffed friends to bring along to the tea party. Oh god. <laughs> oh, please, Rain Rain, go away. Come again when I need you. Just, just listen for my call. Listen for the call of the wild. Oh, where? Oh, where? That's the, that's the call. That's the sound that I make when I need the rain. I just put on my poncho. I don't know where I'm gonna find uh, another, another place to rest. So it could be a, a bad idea to just go running out into the woods and shit like this. Oh. Uh, I've got two to toy triceratops. Two to two toy triceratops. Try to say that ten times fast. Go ahead, I'll wait. Did you do it? Oh, I guess you weren't fast enough. But I appreciate the the effort. If you made it, if you tried, then uh, that was nice of you. Uh, if you didn't try, then I would I would appreciate if you would respect my wishes <laughs> a little bit more. Oh god, this is just a bathroom. Got some chips, got some energy drinks. I grab some of these up. Yeah, I dropped my guns, that's right. So I have uh, plenty of room. Let's load up this cola. Cola and energy drinks. Oh, delicious. Shit is so delicious. And then, this is the man's bathroom. Good. I don't want to uh, break the law, at least in, you know, some countries or cities or states or ordinances. <laughs> and if you go into Target, you can pee wherever you want. You're just like, I feel like a lady today. Everybody move! God, that's not even topical anymore. It seems like everybody's forgotten about that. Uh, people have stopped talking about it because we have a, an attention span of about five minutes. And Target has stopped talking about it because their uh, stock fucking plunged through the floor when they made that announcement. You see, uh, this this agenda that they're pushing is popular with uh, loud people. You know, people who aren't afraid to complain about everything, and then um, people like myself, quote unquote normal people. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll generally remain quiet just for fear of being judged and things like that. Which, you know, happens anyways. I can't really say anything without being judged because uh, I'm a cis white male. I'm a cis white male, dude. I can't have an opinion on anything. 
Oh, so says you. I'll still have my opinion. I still make it known. All right, it's still raining, but I don't want to stick around here all day. Climb over this fucking barricade. We can't do it. Oh, there's a, a car wash? No, it's a storage unit. Okay. That's better than a car wash. I can, uh, I can make do with this. Let's see if we can find some more nails and things like that. Uh. Yeah. Wash bottle? What? What do you wash with the bottle? I don't understand. Get some, uh, slingshot pinch clamp. I don't know what that's for. Glass graduated cylinder. That's for, uh, playing Heisenberg. Playing Heisenberg. You guys want to play Breaking Bad? We're gonna need some, uh, some cough medicine. <laughs> I haven't found any cough medicine yet. Shame that. I bet my zucchinis are, uh, good to go and shit like that. I should really head back home. I've been trying to head back home for quite a while now. I've just, uh, not done a great job of it. <laughs> Oops. Oopsie doops. Oh well. It be what it be. We'll get there eventually. I I hope. <laughs> Probably. It's gonna be fine. We just need to keep running. We need to keep running. Keep pushing. Do the thing. Got so many more fishing traps. Sack. Oh, that reminds me. Uh, I wanted to make a, a rooftop garden. I thought that would have been so nice. But it also uh, seems like a lot of work. Seems like a lot of work, grabbing all that sand and dragging it up a fucking ladder and putting it on the roof. And then and then planting on top of that. And then you gotta make the dirt deep enough. I think it stopped raining. Okay, good. <laughs> yeah, you gotta make the dirt deep enough because if you're growing carrots or something like that, they need a lot of soil to, to dig down into. If you got three inch soil, then you're gonna get two and a half inch carrots. And that ain't good. Your girlfriend or wife isn't going to enjoy that. <laughs> She'll tell you she does, but she's lying. She's just trying to make you feel better. <laughs> I'm sorry if you have a two and a half inch carrot. I'm not I'm not the, the kind of guy that's going to judge you for that, you know? Ain't my business. I don't have to live with it. <laughs> it's a nice snack, you know? But then she's probably going to go to the neighbor for a full meal. Just Just letting you know. Expect that. Know that that's coming eventually. Probably. Unless unless you got a, a decent lady who doesn't really, uh, you know, put so much stock in those things. But let's be honest. Humans, in general, uh, put quite a bit of stock into things like that, don't they? Don't they? That's how the fucking human race has survived. Not just survived, holy shit. The human race has taken over the whole world. You can't go anywhere without fucking people being there. Good God. <laughs> There's just so many of them. That's why I think if a, a super virus was to come and start turning people into zombies, it would probably not like Project Zomboid where you're just like seeing zombies everywhere. Because a lot of them would die, you know. And uh, you also couldn't keep track of where you've been by, by looking at the corpses. But um, I think it would be a really good idea for a virus or super bug. You gotta target humans, bro. Is that what the Black Plague did? I guess so. It just happened to, you know? I don't know if the Black Plague had a plan or something like that. I thought they were just riding around on rats and biting people all willy-nilly. <laughs> probably, probably the fleas bit uh, other animals too, but yeah. Only humans were susceptible to the Black Plague. It, that was that was so long ago. There was way less people then. We get another black plague now. It's over. It's all over. Put it to bed. Done. Oh man. I want to take that shotgun, but I won't. Oh, and now I'm feeling sleepy. Little sleepy, sweepy, sweepy. Oh God. Where can I go? Where can I go? Nobody lives near the gas station. Ooh, what's this? Bargain clothes. I remember this vaguely. I don't think we're going to find anywhere to sleep in here either, but... 
Is there spiffos across the street? Am I remembering that correctly? There's just so many uh, chain restaurants and shit like that. It's hard to keep a, a track of where you been. Where you come from, where you been? I come from my house. <laughs> yes, you do, sir. I want to go back to my house. Well, good luck with that, sir. We're trying our best, but we're not doing very good. I keep di getting distracted. Oh, look at all this. Matches, cigarettes, mm, hunting knife. Yeah, I don't need any of this. I don't need any of this. I don't need cigarettes, I just want them. <laughs> Part of me does. Part of me goes, hey, you're gonna die. <laughs> this is part of the thrill, isn't it? You gotta roll those dice. Oh, fuck. Yeah, this is where the uh, spiffos is. So we're, we're making our way back. Slowly. Slowly but surely. It actually doesn't seem that long on the way back. I don't really want to sleep for, like, ever. Because <laughs> that's, uh, being dead. Here, let's just, let's just see how long the sleep takes. I think that Moodle just popped up, so it should only take, like, four hours, something like that. Hopefully it won't be midnight when I wake up. Wake up! Wake up! Wake up! Holy shit, wake up! Oh my god. It's seven o'clock. Done. Done and done. Well... Now the uh, question is, do I continue on and make this a, a long episode? Or do I just call it and be like, okay, we're good. We're good. We'll set out in the morning. My sleep schedule's flipped around regardless. That's just how it goes sometimes. Well, I think I will call it, friends. I've been Brandon Dayton, your humble narrator. We're gonna get back to our house. We're, we're, we're really close. The tea party's gonna happen. Maybe I'll find some new friends along the way. We'll stop in some houses and check the children's rooms. Because, uh, you know, I like to kill them children zombies. Those are my favorite ones. They're so easy. And they got the soft spot on top of their heads. <laughs> Anyways. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. I hope that you'll like, comment, and or subscribe if you did enjoy the episode. Uh, I'm not gonna sleep, so we'll just wake up and, uh... We'll, we'll trek through the night in the next episode, which should be exciting. I hope that you'll join me for it, and uh, I'll see you in the next one. Thanks again for watching, and until then, friends, bye bye One, two, three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.